What's up, gamers? What's up, gamerinos? I guess that's how we're starting it. Sub gamers? Uh, it's time for Q and A uh, with my wife and Murray. How's it going? Great. Great. We asked Twitter for some questiones, and we're going to answer them now. Amory, you're gonna pick them. Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna ignore all the ones that were directed only at him. That's fine. It's a Q and A with my wife, not Q and A by myself. So. <laughs> Fuck you. Damn! <laughs> First question. Would you guys let the other pick out your outfits? So would you like dress me and let me dress you? You wouldn't want me to dress you. No, I'd want to see what you would like put me in. Yeah, that'd be fun. I, okay, so the question is, would you let the other dress you? Yeah. So I'd, I'd absolutely <laughs> let you dress me. I'd be like... Do I get a say in what I wear? No, you're letting the other person dress no, you. No, I but, wouldn't. Really? Because for me, I, I think your fashion sense is good. But I care about comfort. First and foremost, I care about comfort. I could put you in a comfy outfit that I think is good. Really? Because okay. I only like t-shirts. Okay, I can find you some nice t-shirts. Okay, like, then I'll, I'll, I'll allow it. What, then. Do you, what do you think I'm going to make you wear? Like I don't know, a, like, like a, a jumpsuit? I don't know, like a, like a sweater. Or like. I mean, you, no, you look good in t-shirts, but I think you look good in black, and you never want to wear black, so. I wear black. Only if it's like a t-shirt with a quirky design on it. I mean, if it's black. Just wear a sol I'd put you in all solid black. Okay, I'm not I'm not a goth like you, or a wannabe goth. You don't or have to be goth to wear black. Uh, I'm gonna say I'll say I'll, the whole video is gonna be discussing this. <laughs> this Q and A one question. I'll allow it if she lets me make like give like a, it, it's comfortable to wear. Then I'll allow it. Okay. Uh, I would let you. I would let you dress me. I would just show you my closet and be like, pick something. I would be too much pressure. You'd be like, why? Be like, that's not good. It's and not like, like we have to wear it out. I guess Just that's like true. picking your outfit for like I don't know a cute photo shoot. I don't know. God. Okay. Whatever. Fine. So I would like. I, I I trust you, but you don't trust me. Yeah. That's <laughs> that's the takeaway from that. If you had to choose a board game world for you both to be trapped in for the rest of your lives, what board game would you choose? I'm looking at our uh, shelf. Right obviously, now. Mansions of Madness. No, I'm just kidding. That would be horrible. Oh, are you kidding? Uh. <laughs> Let's see. What's up? Like a, a board game universe to be trapped in as ourselves? We're just gonna look at our shelf for like two hours and be know. like, okay. I like. I think I have one answer that could be cute, but I don't know if that'd be the ideal. Then do Machi Koro. Oh, it's, you're just you're just running a business in a little city. You're just city. in a Japanese you're little port town. You're just vibing, yeah. Or everywhere that. Oh yeah, no, where they, no, straight up. I'm gonna live soon. in Yokohama. That's a board game. Yeah, I'm just gonna live in Japan. <laughs> Uh, I picked this war of mine. No, uh, I... Uh, <laughs> Here's all the ones we wouldn't pick. Um, you know, Everdell, if I was a little furry, little Everdell furry would, creature. Everdell, yeah, you just like, any that's like, you're just living in a little society and vibing and getting trying to little like, berries and... Anything that's like real you know, life, making but a little cute. shop. Yeah. Uh, you're eating berries. Uh, is there anything else? I don't know. Pick, let's pick, let's do like an interesting one that isn't just like, oh, whoa, I'm just living in a little village, a little animal. Well, I'm gonna pick Mansions of Madness. What? Okay, yeah, because you want to go bad and die. <laughs> yes, uh, I'm ready. I, I'm gonna go with Everdell. You know, I'll Everdell's be a good one. I think Machi Koro or like, yeah, probably Machi Koro. Be a mine. cute little just squirrel man or something. <laughs> a cute little squirrel man. Mm -hmm. Can I see Charizard's best impression of Sungwon? Oh, I'd love to hear this. Hey guys, it's me, Prozy. Today I'm gonna eat thirty thousand flavors of chips. That's yeah, is that what I sound like? <laughs> sound like this? Sounds like critical. Sounds like critical. Um, <laughs> That's me doing a deep voice though. But like pretend it didn't sound like What's something I would say outside of a YouTube video? Do you wanna watch some anime? <laughs> What's wrong with that? What's wrong with one? I don't know. Do it hey in guys, the do it in, me. Do, 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 do in you the wanna voice. watch some anime? Do you wanna watch some anime? Hey babe. Hey babe. You never say that. I don't call you babe. <laughs> hey babe. You wanna watch some anime? You wanna watch some anime, babe? <laughs> Uh, wow. Do one of me. I bet you watch yourself. <laughs> <laughs> um, I only watch it if it has a vampire in it. Uh, <laughs> That's not true. I've not watched any vampire anime. Uh, I won't watch it unless it has vampires or uh, it's just bad, like 90 Day Fiance or whatever. Okay, that's reality TV. Yeah, reality TV. Uh, I only watch Slice of Life anime about high schoolers. Uh, love achieving their dreams. What? Again, I'm. That's not making fun <laughs> of me. That's truth. I know. I know. That's I'm, my creed. Uh, that's so <laughs> no shame. No shame. You know that. You know that. You know me. You know me, Jay. Jay's watching this like what Jay's is wrong? Like, what is wrong with her? Yeah. Can you name a single one of my Lolita dresses? And do you have a favorite? 
I know you can't. I just want to see what Baby, you the stars shine That's bright. That's not a dress. It's a Fuck brand. That's uh, a brand, though. See, I'll give you the point for getting a brand. The dresses have names? Yeah, they all have names. Okay, I should. I have a new baby video. starlight. I have a new uh, I, video idea, which is where I just read you a bunch of uh, dress names, and half of them are real and half are fake, and you have to guess which ones are real. Mm -hmm. There's one that's called Cherish My Juicy Cherry. <laughs> okay. So, uh, you know. How about uh, I'm gonna try? I'm gonna say things, and you tell me if there's anything even close. Mm -hmm. Rainbow cutie. <laughs> that sounds like a My Little Pony. <laughs> That's true. No. Uh, uh, Milky Planet. Melty Berry Princess. Melty Berry Princess. Mm -hmm. Okay. Twilight Struggle. <laughs> no, what? Okay, no, I'm moving on to the next question. <laughs> Everdell. <laughs> what are your favorite Smash characters? Not necessarily mains, but characters you like. Okay, why don't we do our mains and then like other ones? Dr. Mario like. is my main. My main is usually Lucina, but sometimes I'll do Roy. I usually do one of those two. And the character I just like? I really like to play as Jigglypuff because if I can land a rest on somebody, it makes the whole thing worth Are it. Are you talking about characters we just like as a character or characters we like to it play as? It's just those ones you just like. So I guess like to play as as well. Just do like to play as because I mean. I like Kirby. Kirby, yeah, you're really good with Kirby Kirby's actually. Cute. You're really yeah. good with Kirby and Dr. Mario. Mm -hmm. I'm. I like to play as like all the Fire Emblems because yeah. they're all just all swords. the swords. All swords with counter. Yeah. Uh, Jigglypuff, which also is kind of like a counter. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I should give Jigglypuff a sword. Jigglypuff should get some. Oh, wait, have you. Is Sephiroth out yet? Yeah. Did you play with him? Mm -hmm. Is he fun? Is, did you play with him? Like, did you have him over? <laughs> did you have him over for Smash? <laughs> did you hang out with Sephiroth? <laughs> uh, yeah, I did play as him. It's pretty, he's pretty good. Has Charizard watched the 2008 Speed Racer movie? If so, what did she think about it? We both watched that, like, for the first time a couple years ago, right? What'd you think of the Speed Racer movie? It was really awesome. Yeah. That it, shit was awesome. It was, it was very I, I only wanted to read this question so that I could talk about how good that movie was. It's, <laughs> it it's, was, a, it's a blast. We got yeah. to watch it in, like, a college movie theater or something. Mm -hmm. It was really fun. Yeah, it was for... Uh, the rap party for Anime Crimes Vision that's Season right. 2. Yep, that's what they did. It was so really we fun. So a, a viewing of Speed Racer. I thought it was going to be so dumb. But it I was is, like, it, but, no, it's but it's great. great. Yeah. If you had to pick your favorite desserts, what would they be? So let's just talk about desserts we like. What's your favorite dessert? Choc you freshly you, baked chocolate chip cookies. Yeah, because you don't like desserts that much. So I mean, They're fine. I'm, but, a, I'm a savory boy. But I have a sweet tooth. So my favorite desserts are like, I really like pies or things with fruit in them. Best pie. Apple pie. Yeah. Apple pie with like I, I don't agree, but that's a good choice. What's your favorite pie? Blueberry. Oh, not... You like pecan too, though. It's not a fruit pie, but... Oh, I, you, well, you said favorite pie. Oh, you said best well, pie. I, 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 I did just say best pie. <laughs> uh, no, I still like blueberry pie more than pecan pie. Blueberry is good. Apple's my favorite. Um, it's very easy to make and very good. With a scoop of ice cream And the there. crust has to be really good. Yeah. Is there anything one of you does that initially you thought was dumb and weird, or dumb or weird, but you came to like and understand their side? I would love to hear your answer on this. Do you have one? No, not yet. You, you know, I think keeping lists mm. to the extent that you do. I do keep a lot he of lists. He keeps extensive like lists and notes on like everything. The thing ever. is, they're really but helpful. But it's really helpful because then later he can like pull them up and be like, oh yeah, are you... I'll be like, hey, what movies did we see this year? Like when we were going to movies when it wasn't like a pandemic. Mm -hmm. And I'd be like, what movies did we see this year? And you're like, let me pull up my list of every movie we've seen in theaters this year. It's and, actually very fun to do. And it's useful. Um, so I think that's something that even though I still like kind of tease you about, I actually am like, no, that's really like organized and useful. And now I can just ask you like, hey, like, did we watch this thing? Or like, when did we watch this? Cause you also, don't you keep like years? Yeah. I yeah, do. it's very organized. Yeah, yeah. Do you do anything weird? Like, not really. Okay, but you definitely were like against folding laundry. <laughs> okay. I'm not against folding laundry. I'm just like too lazy to do it. So when I lived alone, I would just kind of throw them in a basket or whatever and just grab them as I needed. I don't like, who cares? Like, what do you mean it's okay? So you thought it was weird. It's not weird. Everybody does it. I'm just, I'm a, I just was too lazy to do it. You're too normal. You're not weird. I'm a weirdo. I'm the quirky one. I'm the silly one. Um, please use a coaster. Uh, no. Here's a weird thing I do is make people use coasters. Oh, this is the answer. <laughs> oh man, like they gotta use your coaster or else the table will dissolve. Oh my god, who cares? Yeah, because you don't clean anything. <laughs> That's. I mean, it's just water. That's Gatorade. I mean, but I mean, but the okay, Gatorade is not dripping. This is. <laughs> do you think this outside is Gatorade? No, it's just water. It's just. Okay, water. so that doesn't answer the question because it's not a weird thing. It's like because you still think it's weird. 
I don't think it's weird. I just like, okay. Yeah. You know what I think is weird is when you put a glass down next to like so. There's a coaster on the table, and you put the glass <laughs> next to the coaster, not on the coaster. What is you and your wife's favorite movies? What are the main differences between your movie preferences? Don't say it. I'm, let's see if we can name each other's. Yours is Hot Fuzz. Yours is Eternal Sunshine. Yeah. Of the spotless mind. Yeah. Your movie preferences are animated stuff. Anything think, with vampires in it. I think that's not true. I've seen lots Anything of, goth. I've seen lots of bad. No, that I don't just automatically. What are you talking about? What, you what like, are mine? I think you like um weird comedy more than I do. That's more t in general, <laughs> but yeah. That's movie preferences. Kind I of, kind of I kind of like low fantasy. Well, there's low fantasy, but also like the concept has to be like has to hook you, and usually what hooks you is like female led. Which listen, I love female led mm -hmm, yeah. movies too, or they have to be an interesting premise. Yeah. Or, well, yes. or, I anything, mean, I, or literally anything. I don't think anybody is going to be like, wow, I really want to watch this movie with a boring premise. See, I will watch, I'll watch anything once. Uh, and I sometimes I love something that's like, I, there are movies I think I really, I really like that I think you would find absolutely torturous. Oh, of course. Like, uh, but I would, I would say the best way to describe my tastes are ones that have some sort of strong emotional impact, whether it makes me laugh really hard or makes me really sad or makes me something. Like, something about it has to really, like, get at me. Apples or oranges? Apple juice or orange juice? Ooh. For me, it's oranges. Hold on, that's two different questions. Okay, answer both. For apples me, or... Oh, go ahead. Uh, apples or oranges? I'm gonna pick... No, that one I'll pick apples, but orange juice I prefer over apple juice. Do clementines count? Or is it No, apple? that's an orange. <laughs> Wait, what do you mean? No, I mean it's not an orange. Clementines that's an orange! <laughs> it doesn't count! That's Clementine an orange! No, clementines are not oranges. If clementines aren't oranges, then it's apple. apples and apple juice for both. Yeah. Uh, I don't like orange juice that much, actually. I love apple juice. Yeah, I know. Remember that time I bought you orange juice and you were like, I wish this was apple juice. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, <laughs> orange juice is really good mixed with Sprite. Yeah, I do like to... They're here the for The police me. are here for you for... For, 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 for not liking orange juice. For not juice. liking orange juice. What was the least favorite of your Trying Different Food series? Would you ever do one with your wife so that you both can give your opinions and compare them? I would love to do one. Mm. But you are always like, no. Chips Ahoy fucking suck. I they're don't. They're really gross. They're not, like, only of, like, three of the, like however many I had were any good. So I'm gonna say that. Now would I do one with you? The only reason why I didn't or don't is it would like double the length of the video, basically. Uh, Not if we both just ate it at the same time and then kind of like talked about it. Be that bad. We could do like one where it's less of the thing, like not as many. Maybe ones where you I would do, do it, it but in it's like not a that stream. Many. Maybe I think a stream could be fun. But for like one where we just sit down, the way I do it, I can, I can manage to get those done in a pretty quick amount of time, actually. So well, that's why I was saying one where there's not that many different flavors, but maybe you. Still I, I mean, do I wouldn't it. do that. I wouldn't do it then. You could do it with me. We could do a stream, is what I'm saying. We could do a stream and not a full video. Going off that, I saw another question earlier when I was looking at these where it's like, it was asking what we do with all the ones, because you obviously don't eat it all in one sitting, even though I think some people think you do somehow. Oh God, yeah. Um, it was like, what do you do with the leftovers? Because they were very concerned about the food waste. And I just want to say, we don't waste any there of it. There is no food waste. We either eat it all or, or we, we give, give it, it away. away. Yeah. Um, there's no waste. Which one of you is the kitty's favorite? Uh, Effie likes me the best. Sophie and likes me Sophie the likes best. him, but uh, honestly, I think they both like hanging out with me more. He's leaving? <laughs> when you're sleeping, you move too much. I don't think they like it. Sophie likes to hang out with me at night. Yeah, Sophie does. Yeah. Like, if she hears you, she'll run to yeah. the other room. If she hears me get out of my chair, she runs to Yeah, the, yeah. it's really cute. What's your favorite board game or video game to play together? Me and my girlfriend are looking for suggestions, and it would be fun to hear from you. I think Legendary or Aeon's End are two of the really fun ones to play with you. I also really like, um, like, roll and write type games, because they're mm. quick and they're just, like, kind of fun. What's, like, your favorite roll and write? I think uh, Ganchan Clever. The one with the dice where you get like it has like all the different things. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That one's really fun. And I really like the the train one. 
Uh, Railroad Inc. Yeah, mm. Railroad Inc. And then Ganjan Clever and Ganjan Clever 2 were both really good. My favorites to play with, let's say, just her, my legendary, and Zen, especially and Zen. You like deck building games. I like games. escape room games too. Actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exit, escape. exit the room. Yeah, those, those have are been really fun. Was fun. Isle of Cats, right? Mm -hmm. Isle of Cats was really fun. Everdoll's um, fun with two people. Everdoll was good. For me personally, I'm more unless it's like a quicker like roll and write type. I'm more into co-op games for like more lengthy ones, especially with two players. Mm. Um, because it's just more you can talk more about like what should we do, like what is the best like strategy. Whereas right. if it's like competitive and it's just two people, it's kind of more like it's very very cerebral. See, I love, I love you I love that. What fantasy classes do you think you guys are like? For example, like from D and D or any kind of fantasy thing. I think you'd, I think you'd be like a fighter. Yeah. I'm, yeah, you agree. <laughs> I am sword man. You're always sword man. You'd be a fighter. Okay, so if let's let's think in terms of a like Gloomhaven, which we haven't played in a while, but similar. You'd be like a fighter or a barbarian. Yeah, you want to smash. Um, you have not played D and D, right? Or you played once, so you don't. But once. you don't really understand I, like the I was, scores. I was like a fighter. You were a fighter. Yeah, you'd mm -hmm. be a fighter or a barbarian. You want to smash. You want to fight. For me, in any kind of fantasy, anything, I'm always a caster. Mm. Always. And then sometimes I like a little bit of melee combat, but I always, I'm always like want to be a glass cannon. I'm the opposite. I am a <laughs> tank and I will yeah. kill you. Yeah. That's I mean, I'll kill you, but it'll be from far away and probably very uh, brutally with some kind of spell. In Divinity, everyone else in the party does their little spells of like, oh, and then I'm going to put the puddle here and then I'll make it electric and then I'll, I'll do this. Yes! And, this. and for me, I jump in like a bomb with a big like club. And I just smash a guy. See, for me, bits. like, because I'm currently in a D and D game, um, like I'm playing a druid, so I'm like, hey, I'm gonna use nature to like hold that person over there, and mm. then I'm gonna eviscerate them with a different spell, and then our barbarians just like, yeah, I'm gonna take my axe and go smash it, which I think is what you would do, like either fighter or barbarian. Yeah. But because I feel like in like video games, you play lots of just like soldier fighter classes too, and I'm always like, no, I want to cast and do spells and not be near my enemies at all. I want to be far away and watch them suffer from afar. Right. Favorite foods? Can we name each other's? You know mine. Kalbi. Kalbi is mine. Yours changes like every day. I used to be macaroni and cheese. Is it still macaroni and cheese? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just yeah. like a comfort food. Yeah. Like, I won't always pick it, but I, I always am satisfied when I eat it. Yeah. So, no. I love it. That's fair. What's one anime your significant other is into that you just can't get into or hate it? Uh, uh, I wasn't into sound euphonium. I'm sorry. <laughs> I like Slice of Life, but he like loves Slice of Life. So for me, it's like a 50-50 chance if I'll be into it or not. And sometimes I'm not that into it, but if I give it another try later. I think you, I think if we gave sound euphonium another shot, you would. Like even Space Brothers, I'm like, I really liked it. And maybe I would like come back to it in the future, but I'm just not that into it right now. So I don't really want to watch it. Shirobako, I wasn't that into, and then it's okay. You, you like you, it's too it's too slow. It's too. Uh... It wasn't slow. It was just like, okay, yeah, it was kind of slow. See, I don't. That doesn't bother it's me like at all. It's like really long. Doesn't bother me at all. Okay, uh, but what's one that I like? for you is Evangelion. Oh yeah, I like Evangelion, and you. Uh, I don't. Like you don't like Evangelion at all. I respect Evangelion, but I don't like it. Have you picked up any new hobbies during quarantine? Have you? You definitely have. I have as well. Have actually. I? D and D. Uh, oh yeah, but we were doing that before D and D. We were streaming. We were playing that before. Watching Gordon. every goth vampire thing known to man. I mean, what <laughs> that's are you not a hobby. That's just like I don't. That know. is absolutely a Stream hobby. Streaming. Vampire research is a hobby. I'm gonna say streaming <coughs> is the one. Not D and D. You felt D hard. In yeah, D &D. but D and D we were playing before quarantine. You that's, were. Yes. I don't know how time works. <laughs> yeah, you don't. We start. We started about a year ago, so it was like right before. One of my new hobbies is um, setting up, and maybe there'll be a video on this at some point in the future, but elaborate trivia, trivia nights yeah. um, with, I won't go into too much detail, but they're usually, not usually, they're thematic and usually have a lot of rules, but in a fun way. They have like item, like, like you know, items or abilities. I did stream Mario trivia once, and that was an example of that, if you happen to yes. see that stream. But yeah, it was- uh, That is definitely the hobby that you kind of went hard in. Oh yeah. What is the best thing about your mailage? What's your answer? Uh, about our specific marriage? Cause like being married, 
Yo, that's cute. The best thing about your marriage and not just like marriage in general. I'm trying to think of like, cause I could be like, oh, whoa, living with your best friend and all, whoa, whoa. But like, that's just like everybody's answer. Um, I think you are just very fun to be around. You're funny and like, you like to do fun things. Going to Disneyland with you is always really fun. Okay, what's your answer? I think you are also very fun, uh, very reliable. Uh, I think one of the most important, or two of the most important things are, uh, one, I think our sense of humor is completely in line. Even if we don't have the same interests. Oh, for like, sure, yeah. The same... The it's not like we don't have any of the same interests. Yeah, but the rapport and the uh, <laughs> sense of humor is like completely on point. Yeah. And second is complete trust. I don't. I trust her more than anybody in the world. Oh yeah, for sure. Oh yeah, we have never had any kind of like trust issues in any capacity. Right. Like we, we we're are... very honest with each other. We know that each other is like not gonna do something fucking stupid. <laughs> I mean, like you know what I mean, though. Yeah. No. I. Uh, <laughs> it's we're very open with each other. Uh, and yeah, she is my number one confidant. Uh, so I, I, uh, I, it's, a, it's, a, it's about trust. Um, yeah, trust is sure. a good answer. Yeah. I was like, you're really funny. Yeah, <laughs> you, you like, like to go to Disneyland. And you're like, with I you. trust you with my life. I trust you with my life. You're fun to ride Goofy's uh, <laughs> sky school with. <laughs> you make it lighthearted and like fun to be around. Like, if you're just serious all the time, that'd be boring. Yeah. Sometimes he pretends he's gonna be serious all the time when I'm like, stop messing around and you're like, fine. <laughs> what do you recommend as a good board game with seven friends? Just one. Describe it. No, the game is called Just One. No, I know. Oh, okay. <laughs> I know, I know uh, the game. Just One is a game where um, one of you uh, has to guess a word. Everyone else knows the word, and they're writing down cl a clue on their whiteboards. But if any of you write the same clue, they can only write one word. Yeah, if any of you <laughs> write the same word, uh, you can't. You have to put down your whiteboard, and you can't show them. So it's this game of like, you want to give them clues, but if you write something too obvious, they're gonna cancel out. But then sometimes people get nervous that their thing is too obvious. Yeah. And then nobody and then writes write, like, the really weird. obvious thing. Yeah. Something re either they go like, oh, nobody will think if I do the super obvious one. Somebody does. And like four other people. Yeah. Sometimes it's like there's only one word for you to go off of, and you're just like. Yeah. Or they like write something really weird, and like I don't know what the fuck you're talking. Just about. one is really fun. That's a good game for a lot of people. Um. I mean, there's Secret like Hitler. Secret Hitler. Yeah. Any good. party game. Yeah. Not any party game, but. But some. I mean, like you know, good party. Any good party game. Sure. Do you like cooking together? What is your favorite dish to make together? No, I want to cook together. What would you want to make if we were going to cook together? What do you think would be fun to make with me? I'll make whatever. I just, I have no, I have. He's always like, I can't cook. I can't even fry an egg. I can fry an egg. No, you, then why do you ask me to fry eggs for you all the time? Because you fry them better. Yeah, you can't do it. How, I, do you, how do you mess up frying an egg? I always break the fucking yolk. Oh, so. and that is the most important part yeah. to you. So I, um, <laughs> I never, like, I can obviously, like, cook very basic things, but I have no real skill outside of that. And for me, my whole life was like, eh, just buy groceries that are easy to make or order food. That's always been my thing. What do you miss about your hometowns? Or what do we miss most about living in the Midwest in Michigan? Driving. I don't oh yeah, drive. you don't drive anymore. I don't drive anymore because of California. Has, <laughs> California has like weird laws about, I got bad vision. Um, I miss uh, everything being really cheap. Yeah. Cheap rent, cheap cost of Parking. Living. Oh yeah, parking. It was nice, yeah. Obviously, living in California is more interesting. There's more to do. Mm. Um, you know, Los Angeles area is like, there's obviously when it's not quarantine time, there's lots going on, lots to do. Um, so, but I did like living in Michigan. I had, you know, a group of friends there and it was easy. The thing about California is um, it, Los Angeles, uh, if, you're, if your friends don't live very close to you, you're probably not gonna see them very often because nobody really wants to drive here. But in Michigan, I could easily just be like, yeah, I'm gonna go drive and see my friend who lives like an hour away, but because driving was such a non-hassle, it was like not a big deal at all unless it was winter. So I kind of miss just being able to be like, yeah, I'm gonna go and drive somewhere mm. and it's not gonna be sitting in traffic for an hour, it's gonna be actually driving. Sure. I think that's what I missed the most. What were you gonna say? Besides like living expenses and anything driving related, I get asked this question a lot, but I, I like fall too. I do like the season fall. Mm -hmm. Yeah, autumn. But, and rain. 
I do miss rain. Whenever it rains here, it's like, oh. <laughs> yeah, but other than that, I'm very happy here. I liked Michigan. Oh, yeah, no. But I, I, got, I, I got tired of it. Yeah, I don't regret. I don't wish we still lived there, but mm. I, there are things where I'm like, oh. But there's also things, because I'm initially from Maryland on the East Coast, mm. and of course there's things about Maryland I miss too. Yeah. But, yeah. you know, we lived in Michigan together, so I was like, it'd be kind of interesting to answer about like what we miss about it. Sure. Because California is very different. Yeah. I love this question. Do you both like hedgehogs? Yes. Yeah. They're very cute and small. Yeah. Um, does Anne-Marie enjoy your ridiculous food tasting videos or does she hate having no covered space because of all the flavors? I hate having no space because of all the flavors. Uh, has Anne-Marie watched Chihaya Furu? Yes. If yes, then is she team Tai Chi or team Arata? I hate Tai Chi. Arata is team Arata forever. Tai Chi sucks. I'm team Arata. I like Tai Chi. We, oh. It says, do you argue about who's the better character? We don't argue about who's better, no, but we I'm... argue about if Tai Chi is worth anything. Mm. In this world. My argument is that I think Arata, I like Arata more, but Tai Chi has more things going on that I think make him interesting. Do I like Tai Chi more? No. But I think he's an interesting character, for sure. Tai Chi sucks. It's fine. Next question. Would you all want more cats? I absolutely want another cat. But we're in an apartment right now, so we can't. Maybe one more, but that's a lot. No! Three! How many would you want okay, most? Okay, but you didn't want Max. two. You, How many would you three want? Three. Three. Okay, I could live with three. Um, okay, you didn't want two though. And then but then we, we saw a selfie! And then we got two and you'd be like, I love walking into a room and there's two. Yeah. So imagine three. I mean, listen, if, if we stumble upon another cute black cat who has no owner. It has to be a black cat though. Then yeah. we might have to have a third one. That's all I'm saying. All right. Are you optimistic for the future is the one that we'll end with. Yes. Yeah. Anything I, will be better than right now. I think it'll I think it'll be better for everyone. Maybe. Maybe. Hopefully. Hopefully. I don't know. Fingers crossed. I'm, I'm not a seer. Fingers crossed. You're not a seer. I'm not a seer. Even with your snake earrings. My snake no, my snake earrings don't tell me the future, unfortunately. That's why I wore them because I hoped that they would, but they didn't. Mm, what's the point? But yeah, I think, you know. Don't make fun of me. Mm, okay, I never will again. Uh, <laughs> all right, that was Q and A. Thanks for watching. We'll probably do another one in the future. This the last one was like four years ago. So. Yeah, we'll have to review questions that we already answered, <laughs> or maybe not. You know, answers change. That's true. Answers change. Uh, who knows? Maybe in four years we'll do another one. And in four years we'll have met a different way. Yeah, and somebody yeah. asks us how we met. Our food, favorite foods will be different, our favorite movies will be different, and also uh, she'll have become a full snake at that point. A snake, <laughs> yes! A snake witch or something. God, the future really is going to be bright. It's going to be bright. God, yes, I'm ready. All right, bye. Bye.